Deep learning technology allows computers to simulate how our brains work. It is a subset of machine learning, a branch of artificial intelligence. Deep learning uses artificial neural networks that consist of multiple layers of nodes, also known as neurons, that can learn from large amounts of data. Each layer can perform a specific function, such as detecting edges, shapes, or faces in an image. The layers are connected by weights, which are adjusted during the learning process to optimize the output. Deep learning can process unstructured data, such as images and text, and automatically extract important features and patterns from the data. For example, deep learning can recognize objects in photos, generate captions for images, translate languages, synthesize speech, and more. Deep learning can be of different types, such as supervised, unsupervised, and reinforcement learning. Supervised learning is when the neural network learns from labeled data, such as images with names of objects. Unsupervised learning is when the network learns from unlabeled data, such as images without names of objects. Reinforcement learning is when the network learns from its own actions and rewards, such as a self-driving car that learns how to navigate traffic. In that example, the deep learning algorithms score how well the system has performed at tasks such as steering and braking. Higher scores reinforce successful strategies, much like positive feedback from a driving instructor with human students. Deep learning is the technology behind many popular AI applications, such as chatbots, virtual assistants, self-driving cars, and more. Deep learning has many advantages over traditional machine learning methods. It requires less human intervention and pre-processing of data. It can handle complex and non-linear problems. It can achieve higher accuracy and performance. However, deep learning also has some challenges and limitations. It requires large amounts of data and computing power to train. It can be difficult to interpret and explain its results. It can be vulnerable to errors and attacks. Therefore, it is important to understand how deep learning works and what it can and cannot do, and how we can use it responsibly and ethically.